Hello teachers, in this video I will guide you how you can quickly share the study content which you are teaching in the class. So to do that you have to go to the Flipland application and go to the study content tab out here that will be under the school tab. So study content press on it. Here then you have to choose the class course and chapter. Once you have done that you can press on ok. So right now I have done class 8 English and adjectives. So here I want to share some study content and there is a button called as create study content. Press on that. Now it is asking you to give it a name, so I can give you give it a name as adjectives uh, study content, maybe notes, and I can add some description to it. Please read, and then I can press on the upload attachment and upload button. So press on upload, and here will be the all the list from where you can upload this document. So it can be a flip and content. It can be a camera, it can be import or your own content. So, for example, I want to click a picture. I can go to the camera. If I have it in my gallery, I'll go to the import option. If that video is available in my Flipland content, I can, I can explore that into Flipland content and send it to the students. So, I'll press on camera right now and press on done. So, here are my notes, for example. So, whatever my nine notes are, I will just create a picture of it. and done so my image is attached over here you can see that's a media now you want to maybe attach a youtube video so there is a link so there is a option to add link press on that now you can paste the url over here so whatever youtube you know video you have you can write or mention just copy and paste that uh, video here i'll press on add button so you can see this video is attached this uh, this file this picture is attached so all of the things that you want to send that send to the students you can you know attach it over here under that now press on publish now once you want to publish now you can just choose the classes you want to send it to okay in case you want to select the students you want to send it to specifically there's a list of all the students you can choose whosoever is going to see this message press on save so right now let me choose all the classes here i can give the specific start date and end date so i can uh, give it for example uh, for four days that the students have to read this in four days and that's it press on publish so publishing a study content is done successfully and the students have got the notification now you want to track for example uh, how many students have you know seen this uh, message uh, this study content or not so go to the dashboard now that's the study content you can see right now zero attempts so you can press on that and you can press on view attempts and you can see right now zero students have seen it so view student wide if i want to see these are all the list of all the students in my class this assignment has been sent to and once they start seeing this will turn into two of two two of two that's it thank you so much